Okay. Um, I'm going to um, talk about uh, in the search tool, search interface to search uh, annotation patterns uh, that are stored in uh, multiple layers uh, of annotation sets. Uh, the talk will be in two parts. Uh, the first part, the introduction part, will be presented by me, and uh, Kevin will present about uh, usability style. Um, Pub notation, a little bit of introduction to uh, pub notation is that mm, uh, the purpose of pub notation is to maintain multiple sets of annotations uh, made to uh, shared documents and uh, annotations are collected on a pub notation framework and uh, uh, they are linked to each other. So, uh, briefly, oops. This is um, the front page of uh, pub annotation, and uh, you can see uh, many annotation sets are collected, and they are all aligned to the same um, set of text. Uh, so they are all linked through a shared text. And um, so, like this, uh, particularly these um, uh, annotation facts are all uh, kind of those collected through these um, block events. So, uh, uh, more and more annotation facts are uh, now collected on a uh, annotation. And um, then, uh, once um, that many a uh, number of annotation sets are uh, collected and uh, aligned. Then next, what we need to think about is, I think, on accessibility. Uh, when resources are linked to each other, uh, I think um, reachability is improved. So we can reach to uh, uh, link the resources through uh, those links. Uh, but then, I think uh, we want to search uh, those resources by representing our search need uh, precisely. Uh, so, uh, eventually we want an interface to search uh, the piece of information um, we want. And uh, uh, <coughs> the particularly annotations collected on top annotations are uh, some of them are linguistic annotations, and some of them are semantic annotations. And semantic annotations particularly uh, allows access to the content of literature based on semantic computation. And um, so, IDF is now uh, emerging as a standard for a semantic representation. And um, semantic representation is, I think, it is uh, me. It is. From my perspective, semantic representation. Representation itself is not a goal of science, I believe. It is a mean. And, uh, uh, we have a goal we want to achieve through the mean, and uh, that would be computation and semantic computation, search or interoperability or provenance measurement. That would be main goals. And uh, particularly, in this work, what we would like to achieve is actually search. So, uh, uh, focusing on the search, uh, we are trying to develop uh, a tool that will enable us to search the content of a uh, collected corpora. And uh, for the search language, uh, the natural choice was um, Sparkle, because um, now semantic, yeah, Sparkle is now a, a kind of a, a standard uh, search, search language uh, for semantic web resources. And um, uh, for the vocabulary, uh, the natural choice, first choice was actually an um, open annotation, uh, but um, we uh, found uh, open annotation 
vocabulary is um, uh, heavy to for kind of non-technical users to write their own search in need. So uh, we designed new vocabulary which we call uh, text annotation ontology. Uh, and this is an example of search query uh, represented by using the power uh, vocabulary. So in in this query, uh, what is written is uh, uh, we are inter interested in two objects, O1 and O2. And O1 is a uh, pantry bank uh, preposition. And O2 has a class. And the class, uh, it is a, a regular expression, uh, representation. The class might have a organism, so what we eventually would like to find is uh, two objects. One is a uh, pentagram uh, preposition, and uh, the other is uh, an object which, which is described by uh, organism. And uh, O1 is denoted by S2, and O2 is denoted by S2, and S1 is followed by S2. So it's a uh, uh, simple representation, and uh, this is the result. So, uh, if we try to, when we try to uh, represent the same piece of information using uh, open annotation, the theory became uh, uh, very complex, and uh, we thought uh, it's kind of hard to uh, non technical users to write that kind of complex theory. Uh, that's why we, uh, we designed this uh, simple vocabulary to simplify uh, the query uh, authoring. And, uh, so uh, this is, it, it is not just an example, it actually uh, we have a prototype system. So you can actually access this prototype system and uh, here the, the, the query example I just showed uh, is shown and uh, uh, the power notation is searched and this is the result uh, searched from uh, power notation and uh, in this example actually uh, this piece of information is searched from uh, craft tree back and this piece of information is searched from uh, craft semantic notations. So it works on uh, multi layer notations. And uh, you can also specify uh, which uh, annotation uh, step you want to search by specifying the graph. And uh, this is the introduction to uh, the notation query interface. And uh, Kevin will uh, talk about the result of a usability study of this uh, framework.